So I just woke up. I was gonna do this anyways, but I'm like, you know, I might as well do the YouTube video as well because I haven't been on here in a while, right? So, you see the title? I'm gonna have to show y'all how I got these curls, y'all, because let me tell you something. This was done by Flexi Rods, right? Usually, I have mad shrinkage. When I do stuff like this, I'm like, ah. That's why y'all never see, like, my natural curl pattern, like, in this prime, I guess, because it'd be a <laughs> I'm gonna show you how to get this. Um, I'm sad to see this go because I'm gonna have to brush some of the curls out in order to achieve this look. Oh, we're so hard. Nah, it took like uh, three hours. That's including, you know what I'm saying? Like washing my hair, conditioning. So yeah, that's gonna be another video. Let me know if y'all even want that. Yeah, it's like real simple and ooh. Y'all see it, y'all see the look. You see the curls. Y'all, this would be so cute, like in the two puffs. Oh my goodness. Y'all, I was having like a dry scalp issue. I was starting to see like, like, <clears throat> this is kind of embarrassing, but tell me why I looked down at my phone. And I was like, oh my God, my edges are itching, like scratch. I knew it was winter, but that right there, it was snowing. I was, <laughs> you know, them glitter videos and they just like, Phew. I was like, damn. I mean, you know, we all, come on now, come on now, come on now, come on now. If it's not gel, you know, we all be having little flaky flaky sometimes. I'm gonna tell y'all how I, you know, recover from that. Okay, this is not the video for that. I'm, I'm gonna tell y'all, like, I'm gonna give y'all some, some, like, hair do's and don'ts. That's what it's gonna be, hair do's and don'ts. Ooh. Let me show y'all something, let me show y'all, because you already see, like, ooh. girl, Casper done push me down. Let me show them, y'all. Okay, so, I made these, right? It took me two days to make, you know, one start every day. I mean, one start each day. Honestly, it could have took me one day, but, you know, I just I just got distracted and stuff. This is why it took me so long, right? I made this from scratch. I know how people have hearts in their hair. Two flexi rods, right? You just, you know, make your heart. You can get different lengths of flexi rods, by the way. So if you don't want it this small, then... Yeah, but you, you get the gist. Just, you would push this back, take this one off, take this one off, like the white part, and then connect them through the wire part. Silver thing right here, sorry guys. The hook, so you would connect them. So I'm not gonna do all that because I, you know, I just don't feel like it. So when you do that, then it's obviously gonna be linked together and it's gonna be easier for you to, you know, wrap uh, braiding hair or whatever hair you want, curly hair, whatever. Um, and you know, that's just that. So that probably would take you like less than an hour. But let me tell you something. I got some wires, bro. I tried this flexi rod method with stars, but stars got all this like, you know all these all these little crevices. It just wasn't giving me like the points I needed. I was like, you know what? I'm still gonna use these flexi rods because I mean that's all I got. I cut get another piece, snip snip right here, right? And they wasn't even coming out even like you know if you if you ever try to like just cut two things and try to make a point together, you know how even they have to be, and that's just a whole lot of work. So I was like, dang, bro, I can't even do it until I came across this. You must be asking. How did this thin piece become this? I took a piece of paper, drew a star. I basically traced that paper star with this wire and it's it's harder than it looks. They so thin, so it's like, bruh, the flexi rods, it's like, there's already this foundation. This color hair, I wrapped it as a base. Once I'm done with the base part, get some got to be the, the, the spike and glue and just do that. I wrap some hair. And say it, say it, it only took up this much, this part. So now it stopped right here. You don't want this to unravel as you finna get the other piece of your hair. So you're gonna get the glue, you're gonna do like this, this motion, get the blow dryer, dry, 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 get the other piece. You do the same thing for this, same thing for this, same thing for this, same thing for this. And that's just the base. That's just the base to get it thick. Spray the whole thing with uh, the free spray, the got to be free spray. And then, you know, blow it on my, see it's a piece right now, I'm trying to. Then you wrap the purple hair over and you gotta be all precise and stuff. So it can be like, a, you know, kind of even throughout. It's just hard. Then you gotta make sure the other one is kind of relatively same in size. This one is thicker, but it's like, I wasn't about to just go back. It looks. 
oh man i do notice a difference and it's kind of bothering me <laughs> it's actually bothering me anyway so those are the stars we're gonna get into it let me show you guys my drawing hope you guys can see why why i lose my water spray bottle for my hair well i only had this and i was just like bruh who is buying another one i'll get another one i think it's like it, it should be like a dollar at the dollar tree i don't know i don't know guys i don't know should i make my hair purple mm. i'm just sitting in bare silence i'm not gonna lie we're gonna have to we don't have to make this a voiceover like, we're gonna change this to a voiceover guys sorry all right, so this part is a bit self-explanatory. Um, I'm just parting horizontally in the middle of my head. But have y'all ever tried FaceTiming yourself to see like your parts like from the back? Like, like, no? Okay. So I think I have it. I'm gonna look in the mirror, but what y'all think about the part? Is it straight, guys? Don't lie to me. Don't lie to me, be real, be real. It looks pretty straight, looks pretty good. So now, I'm hungry mid-recording? No, ma'am. I'm sorry, guys. I know I always eat during the videos, but it's like, bro, like, I really... I don't know why I get so hungry when I'm doing it. <laughs> I might start a mukbang channel. I like watching people eat, too. I know for some people that's weird, but, like, I like watching people eat, and I stand by it. I might, like, you know, just eat in front of the camera and just, like, talk. You know? I'm sorry, but I'm about to get something to eat. You know what I mean? Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I opened the fridge, bruh. I was like, dang. Closed it. Opened it again, bruh. I'm gonna make some noodles, though. Speaking of food, I am clean from my DoorDash addiction, bruh. I, I've been... How many months clean? I've been two days clean. I'm actually... I've been, like, half a year without DoorDash. I'm about to get my noodles. I'm about to check out my noodles. Actually, you guys wanna come with me? You guys wanna come? Come on. Come on. So, we're gonna get... The second best flavor chicken. Yes, I said second best flavor. You know we can't just have the poison in the noodles. Like we have to spice it up. Like black pepper, onion powder, a little bit, a little, little bit of this, cause this, 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 this is spicy. This will take you all the way down the hill. Curry powder. I'm feeling fancy. Poison. A little bit of this, bro. Now I have my noodles. I never get my nails white because like I always use curry and like it just stains it. I definitely slurp my noodles. I have no idea what to talk about. I'm just, I'm just hungry. Maybe when I do a mukbang channel that like, you guys can give me topics, but the only thing that be on my mind is the food. <laughs> I think last time I had like Chinese food, I had like some shrimp and like seaweed. I'm not gonna put too many clips of me eating because I don't think people clicked on it for this video and I would hate for them to just like click out because they feel uncomfortable. <laughs> yeah, I'm done now. It's done. I need some water after that. Okay, you caught me. I didn't really get water. <laughs> Those sparkling uh, wine soda thing. That was good. Hello for everybody that skipped. Um, actually, I had a good meal. Thanks for asking. The way YouTube copyright is, like, you play five seconds of a song and they like, no money. You would not get paid. This first. Ooh. Ooh. We like sleekness around here. Before I brush my hair with gel, I try to get the curls out by brushing it with a Demon brush. And then before doing the ponytail, I place my star to see where it's kind of going to go. And um, yeah. After that, you're going to just kind of comb out the perimeter of your hair. Um, I could care less about the adult hair, baby hair debate. Um, if it's at the perimeter of your head, use it. 
Like, who cares? You know what I'm saying? Do what you gotta do. Because if you ain't had no edges, they're gonna call you bald. So either you wanna be bald head with no edges, or, you know, I mean, there's nothing wrong with bald head people. Okay, I'm about to, okay. Anyways, so I'm spraying my hair with got to be glue and then brushing it because if you don't want flyaways, then definitely use that free spray. And then I'm blow drying it with the blow dryer. And after that, I'm going to basically do the other side, so. What you're seeing me do here is braid my hair um i don't think it really matters the amount of braids and i don't know if it will make it easier if i use braiding hair or not but by all means y'all try it and y'all let me know which one was easier so it can help some people out but this is just what i did so you want to build a strong base a strong foundation for them um, stars to sit on and this part is really tough because my stars were flimsy so if you can do better than me and just find some sturdy wire stars or something like in a star shape or whatever shape you want So it took me the entire day to do this other star right here. Like seriously, like forget what I said earlier. Don't don't use wires. I'm just showing you what I did. So don't use wires. It was pissing me off. Like, bro, right right about here is when I was about to give up. I'm so serious. I <laughs> So I sprayed it with the free spray thing that was gonna do something, and it sure as hell didn't. Um, but I sprayed it too close, and yeah. <clears throat> yeah this took me about three hours like this is ridiculous like and i can't even move for real because you know it's gonna go backwards i don't know like maybe if i have some string or something and it will work better but i don't have no string so i like it okay, let me put all these hair products up guys and then we'll get back yo how because i don't i'm not finna wear this I mess around cut this shirt this would look good from the side because i know you're like what's the side view girl like y'all y'all know what's going on don't ask me for no side view and you know it's ugly stop trying to be funny look i feel like it would look cute. i feel like it would look cute if you just you know just do better than me like just have it sturdy and then, you know, have it standing up straight and then it would be like really really cute like seriously i don't know if y'all like heavy on knowing exactly what products i use but trust me it don't matter because that's exactly what i be thinking when i go to the store it do not matter what's the cheapest like you get what i'm saying i don't want to recommend anything i don't know if it's like good or not like i don't know the benefits pros cons like um, but yeah so using this for my eyebrows right not me having a beard and a mustache y'all never see like my acne and like my trust me it's there it's you know i'm grateful for the lighting because you know it definitely eliminates it but um i don't think it's not there because it is okay so i think now would be voiceover time yeah I'm listen to my music sorry guys okay guys so it's back to me um i'm just outlining my natural eyebrow shape with the eyebrow pomade and if your natural eyebrow shape isn't as neat of a guideline then i would suggest using concealer and carving out that shape first because it will make your life easier now basically what you're going to see me do is outline the star with white and then fill it in with color 
so for the colors i just used you know same colors as a star galaxy colors type thing and i'm using the matte book um support black owned businesses i'm gonna link it down below but their eyeshadows are very pigmented i really suggest using them i'm sorry to say to some of you but like my freckles are never real um girl i've been using this prickle pen i'm gonna link it down below i also added glitter to my star because it's supposed to be the galaxy so yeah now i'm just putting lash glue to my lashes blow drying the lashes um be really because i'm impatient uh don't judge me but um anyways Also, I don't know if you're supposed to do this, but um, I definitely blow dry my lashes after I put them on. I don't know if like you're supposed to do that or not. At the time, I just wanted to give those think smarter, not harder type of vibes. So, <laughs> so for the bottom lashes, I wanted them to be dramatic as well. So I basically cut that lash you just saw me put on my face and applied them to my lower lash. I have some white mascara and I'm just applying that to the eye with the star because I want it to be like a little inverted look and per usual I'm adding my little planet and highlight. All you see me doing here is basically adding purple and blue hair paint wax to my edges and my braids so that everything can flow nicely and it can match. Okay guys that's it for this video. Um, I hope you like it. Cause I like it, you know. Um, I do feel like it will look cute, like without it, like just a little cute. Thanks for watching. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And um, bruh, just, bruh. it's like it's dark out now, but I just want to show y'all my stick. You know what I'm saying? Hold on. Go ahead. Stop playing with me. Stop playing with me. <laughs> um, if you're not following my Instagram, what are you like? I'm not even, you know what? That's embarrassing. Anything I feel like is going on his YouTube channel. So if you see an Eden video, then you just see an Eden video. Subscribe and um, let me know what's up.